Welcome back to Tomb Raider. It's been a few days. But we were returning back to the Hidden City. After some very scary stuff over somewhere. Yeah. In the scene Laura, if you can hear me. I'm here. We're not at Unuratus. We're in a cave nearby. The entrance is marked with a heron and an eclipse. On my way. Mama says it upsets the waterfalls waka if I play in the cave. She just thinks it's too dangerous. It was a trap. The box was taken and Unaratu was captured. We heard. We're working on a plan. She's being held at the prison by the old temple. Akan led a raid and was taken too. We'll charge the bridge that leads to the prison. It's aggressive. What if I climb up here, free her, and then signal to attack? That could work. Let's leave scouting the temple in the upper district. You could find your way in. 
I'll go talk to him. We'll have backup ready once you get her out. Sounds good. For strength and safety. Thank you. Laura. I'll get her out. I know. Really? You believe that? The great Sinchichika and the shield of the Age Maker. Why not? Listen to yourself. It's a myth. Unuratu believes it. That's enough for me. Give us all the three of them already. It's a store. Lara. Yes? I am Korianka. Unuratu has spoken very highly of you. I was the one who opened the way to the old barracks when Etsy was captured. You played a part in that as well. We are sisters of the same cause. Ah, I see. Your tattoo, are you... One of the Shorn Ones, yes. But that was another life. Before Amaru, when we stood for something else. He dissolved my order in favor of his priests. I am all that is left. But I swore an oath. Never take a step backwards in battle. So now I wear the colors of the rebellion. I am duty bound to Queen Unuratu. Well, the reputation of the Shorn Ones is well known to me. Historically speaking, it's an honor. You're too kind. I heard you speak of Emperor Sinchi Chika. Yes, the first emperor of Paititi. He is Unuratu's ancestor. He made this age everything we see, touch, smell, everything we fight for now. I've never heard of this shield before, the... The shield of the Age Maker. It is the evidence this rebellion needs that Unuratu is the one to lead Paititi into the next age. Inscribed on the shield is the ordination ritual. The ritual will prove Queen Unuratu is the next age maker. That only she may create destiny, and not that false god, Amaru. And where is the shield? Hidden. Deep within the mountain, beyond the path of Huracan. The path of Huracan? It is a trial, designed to test all those who seek the shield. You've already tried? That was my mission before Etsley was captured. Unfortunately, I had to divert. Since his rescue, the cult knows we're planning something, so... Now I must prepare our fighters, and the shield must wait. Only I fear that if we wait too long, Amaru may get to it first and deny Unuratu's claim. If Amaru gets the shield, he can unite Paititi behind whatever story he chooses and proclaim himself the Age Maker. He'll remake the world as he sees fit. Yes. That can't happen. I was hoping you would say that. That's my friend over there with Uchu. His name's Jonah. I'll contact him if I find anything. I'll stay close to him. Thank you, Lara. Uchu and I were talking, and, well... Uchu, what's on your mind? The day of Edsley's coronation is approaching. Soon he will be a man and take the first steps towards becoming Paititi's future king. Oh, that sounds like a day to look forward to. It's the hope for that day that keeps a lot of us fighting Amaru and his cult. Sometimes we all need to remember what we're fighting for. Is there something I can help you with? When Edsley's father, Sairi, died, Unaratu bestowed the honor of surrogate father unto me. One of my duties is to gather three sacred items for the ceremony, but... But with all that's happening right now, you aren't able to. What are these items? They are the Savior's amulet, the Champion's bow, and the King's horn. Each a blessing from the ancestors of the future King. Tell me what you need, and I'll see what I can do. I already have men retrieving the amulet and bow, but if you could find Kabil, the instrument maker, and get the King's horn from him, he would be doing us a great favor. He's been difficult. I sent two men and both have failed. Perhaps you could talk to his wife. I think I can manage that. Be mindful. 
Kabil can be prickly sometimes, but Abra, his wife, has a way of dulling his edges. Have more rebels been captured? Ishiki, maybe you can help. I sent five men to steal the cult of Kukul Khan's weapons for the rebellion, but the mission failed. In former times, I would have led them myself, but now I can't fight. I can't even run, or else I start to cough up blood. But I'm still a good planner, or I was until today. My comrades were caught and strung on posts throughout the lower village as a warning. They're going to hang there until they die. You said I might be able to help. Yes. With your serpent card attire, you can untie all four of them and no one will suspect you. Four? You said there were five men on the mission. There were. Kolki was leading them, but he wasn't captured along with the others. Nobody's seen him. He's probably been killed. Or oh, he's a traitor. I'll see what I can do. Thank you again, Lara. The rebellion must have the shield of the Age Maker. I just hope we're not too late. Point mace, cast from copper, with an embedded axe blade. A fearsome weapon. The cult of Kukul Khan has gone too far. The time to strike is now. They push and push, and all we do is take another step back. If Unaratu is unwilling to do anything, then we should move forward without her. Freeing the rebels is the mission mission, is it? Oh no, that's still side mission.
Thanks again, Ishiki. I'm happy to have my dice back. Come quick! It's the Ishiki! What do you want? We don't have time for Unuratu's rebellion right now. Are you Kabil? Uchu sent me for the king's... The king's horn? The call to the future? <laughs> Look at the good that future's done for my present. Just go! The cult found out my dad was making the horn. They poisoned our crops as punishment. Mom got sick. My brother Kuali went to the market to get herbs, but... He hasn't returned. That's terrible. Let me see if I can find your brother and get the herbs you need. Thank you. Did you hear about Kwali? No. What happened? Abra was pulled. Excuse me. Ah, Ishiki. How can I help you? I'm looking for Kuali, the son of Kabil. That poor boy. Chimali, one of Kukulkan's thugs, is holding him in a cell up at the market, waiting for the Ahau to come to punish him. Thank you. Be well, Ishiki. That's so beautiful. Watch the rabbitic! How is everything? Welcome. I await your return. Thieving bastard. I... A herb thief. He must be very dangerous. Today it's theft, and tomorrow it's murder. That's quite a leap, don't you think? You really want to know what I think? I think we should round up all these little rats and drown them. Every one of them, especially Yumil. His father may be a serpent guard, but he is not. Hello there. The Ishiki. Wonderful. More attention we don't need. What do you want? I'm trying to help Kuali. The thief. You're too late. He's been sentenced to death for stealing. Seems harsh for petty theft. You can judge when he steals from you, outsider. Well, thank you for the information. Whatever. Kikitano. Thanks. 
standing directly in front of me. Come on, get it! Oh, you missed! So close! Hello there. Hey, you're Ishiki. From the outside, right? Yes, it's nice to meet you. Well, me. I'm Yami. <laughs> what sort of game are you boys playing? It's not a game. My father is a serpent guard, a priest. I took his ceremonial knife to show my friends, and Shimali the guard saw. Shimali knows what father would do if he found out I took the knife, so he threw it up there. Now it's stuck. Oh, let me see what I can do. Wow, really? Thank you. Thank you, Ishiki. You're welcome. Hey, wait a minute. The grown-ups around here always chase us away. But you helped. What do you want? Shh, I'll do the talking. So what do you want, Ishiki? I mean, is there something we can do to pay you back? I'm trying to help Kuali. You're too late. He's been sentenced to death. We can't do anything. And Chimali the guard hates you. Would Chimali chase you if you provoked him? Why? Because if he's not at his post, I can get to Kuali. Yeah, I like it. Oh, you can tell Kuali to meet us at the cave. He'll know where it is. It'll be safe for him there. I will. Let's go. Asto, Remy, with me. Samin, watch our backs. Then run to the cave. Stand back, Ishiki. We'll give you an opening. Chimali, you coward! You'll end your life as a slave. Come taste my blade. <laughs> yeah, and taste llama patties too. Run, run! Little thieves should be punished. Please, they were just herbs. I beg you, I'll work it off. I swear. Your brother told me of your troubles. Wait, who are you? Someone who wants to help. I never wanted any of these to happen. I was only trying to help my mother get well. Where are the herbs? Give them to me. I will heal your mother. Go. Your friends are waiting for you at the cave. Thank you. Here are the herbs. I'll run as fast as I can. What were you doing with your friends near the wilderness? I thought I told you to go. Kuali is safe and I have the herbs your wife needs. Really? And did you come to cure her or to barter for the king's horn? Here, this will help you. Bless you, Ishiki. Kabil, quit being an ass. Give her the horn. Here, with respect to the future king, thank you for all you've done. Thank you. May they all be cursed. Have you come to finally kill me? I'm not with the cult. 
I'm a friend here to free you. That's an effective disguise. Can you use it to free the others and find Kolkwi? I hope so, but I don't know what happened to him. He's alive. Kolkwi's alive. In the confusion, I heard him shout, ordering a retreat. I'm sure he's alive. So many of our warriors have been captured. If they are not freed, they could be sacrificed, assassinated. They'll not see me beg. You're wasting your time. I'll never tell you anything. I'm not here to interrogate you. I'm here to free you. Bribery? Life as a traitor would be worse than death. I'm sure it would, but I'm a friend. Thank you. Friend? You're welcome. You and your friends are safe. No. The cult was expecting us. A spy has infiltrated the rebellion. Mother, father, soon we will be reunited. Am I in the afterlife? Are you a spirit? No, I'm very much alive, as are you. <laughs> a mortal and an immortal. There. You're free to go. Yes. I have been liberated. Why? Tu men magua punta Williken. Cowards, all of us. This is what we deserve for failing so miserably. Don't be so rough on yourself. You'll live to fight another day. We didn't fight. We gave up when we were surrounded. Marched off to die without a single drop of blood on the ground. Thank <laughs> you. 
Ya vi tiene su kilo. Setenta segundos. Y la witch. Que se catupul. I've freed your friends, and there's more good news. Colqui is alive. He was in the lead when the others were surrounded. He shouted a warning and ran away. That's excellent. There is one concern. You may have a traitor in the rebellion. I know we do. I learned who he was while you were gone, and I'm going to personally see he gets what he deserves. All right. Here, take this as a thank you. I appreciate all your help. If you're right about Kolkwi, he would have gone to the mountain safe house. Can you go find him, please? Let him know we have retreated to Skull Cave. I'll find him. Thank you again, Lara. The Rebellion must have the shield of the Age Maker. I just hope we're not too late. Last to leave and first to return. Jonah's stories of you are true. The King's Horn, as requested. Did Kabil give you any trouble? You were right about his wife. She definitely had a way with his heart. Thank you for this, Lara. Of course. Uchu, what did you mean, last to leave and first to return? The men I have retrieving the other two items, they both left three days ago. Neither has returned. Do you think something's happened to them? It's Quentin that concerns me the most. He's young, likes to take risks. Jumps into the water before checking to see how deep it is. I know the type. Jonah. Jonah's right. That describes Quenty perfectly. I never should have sent Quenty to that damn place. Mm, what place is that? The old cistern. It's where the remains of Manko are kept hidden from the cult. Who is Manko? He was a farmer who led Sairi and Amaru's ancestors out of Cusco to safety centuries ago. He is known as the peasant savior. It's his amulet we need for the coronation. Why was Manco hidden away? Manco's followers were known as the Order of the Peasant Savior. This rebellion was born from it. When the cult of Kukulkan first took power, they tried to wipe out the Order. Manco was hidden away in a secret place and kept safe. But over time, as the Order dwindled, the memory of that place has faded. If you like, I could go look for Quenti. You've done a lot already. Bringing back the King's Horn was a big gesture of friendship. I don't mind, really. Maybe Quenti can show me the best cliffs to jump off. Please don't encourage him. The entrance to the cistern is a cave above the white tree. Follow the trail, it'll lead you to it.
close to the white tree one, so let's do that one first. <laughs> Another one. God damn it for all these side missions. We've been staring at this thing all day. I don't understand what it's trying to say. What are you doing? I'm trying to read this stupid mural. I will. Show respect. I'm sorry, Ahau. I mean no disrespect to Kukulkan. I'm studying the murals to become a serpent guard, <coughs> like my father. I'm sure he's very proud of you. But what if I can't understand the lessons they're teaching? Then what? Maybe I can help. Do you think your father would mind that? Would he, Mayu? No, child. I'm sure your father would be pleased to learn you've had the Ahau's help. Great. I've got part of this first one here. It's water. Well, something about water anyway. Uh, I think. And the others I haven't looked at yet. How about I go and study all the murals and then come back to you and we can discuss them? I'll be here. I'm Lara, by the way. I will. Okay, I can get them in a second on my way to the other one. We should track all the side missions, but once, not just one at once. Uchu said the entrance to the cistern was a cave above the white tree. There's the entrance. Mysteriously unlocked now. Locked up. The threat of the disease held at bay. We soon learned that Lopez had come and gone. Some of us began to suspect his betrayal, while others worried for his safety. The only course of action was to remain in the city, the reasoning twofold. We'd be ready when Lopez came to his senses and returned the artifact, or well, this would be the easiest point from which to mount a search for him. We struck an accord with the king. We would become his royal guard, physicians, and priests. This shows a pilgrimage from a great city. This must be Manco, leading the priestess's ancestors out of Cusco. Something's wrong. No one's been through here in centuries. This has to be the right place. The remains of the peasant savior have been moved to an undisclosed location. We've had reports of the cult stealing objects and artifacts and holding them hostage in exchange for docility. 
We will not allow such a sacrilege to happen to Manco. This could be an effigy of the peasant savior. It might have been stolen by the cult of Kukul Khan to keep the Paititians from worshipping it. Or maybe it was given to them as payment for protection. Manco's resting place. This looks suspicious. suspicious but then help for it anyway. This looks like a procession of the dead. It's the order hiding Manco from the cult of Kukul Khan. This shows burial dolls, pottery, and textiles being placed in here with the dead. This wasn't just a hiding place. The order turned it into a crypt. This lever should raise the water level. Fucking <laughs> almost got trapped in. I've done then. The order left members behind as sentinels when they sealed the system. All these bones, they sacrificed themselves to protect this place. on the other side as well. I missed something because of it. I 
Hello, Menko. Now, where's the amulet? Now, to get this back to Uchu. Pure silver. From what I understand, Manko was a simple farmer. This must have been made posthumously as an offering to honor him. There's light coming through this wall. Another sealed up passageway I met. We chink geek. It's right in front of me, being blind. When what is above him is now below, the fed become the food that sow. The ground, the earth, Amun, the corn god. within him like a bird, but do not breathe. Water? So him must be Chuck, the god of rain.
first three of this point. Oh, no, I'm a for God's sake. This is he erases the dark and brings the day that follows. That's the sun. Kenichi Hao is the sun god. The gods in the murals are all giving life and taking it away. A balanced interaction. The murals were teaching about the duality of life and death. Heavy stuff for a child. This is terrible. Hello. Aha, greetings. Have you heard? It's so terrible. Sumak was killed by his own servant. How do you know Sumak? Everyone knows Sumak. He was my mentor and business partner. He, he made my business possible. Trade in the upper district without the right contacts, it's, it's impossible. Sumak did all that for me and more. I'll find out what happened to him. Thank you, Aha. Apologies, Aha, but you may not enter. The crowd is violent. If I move, they may rush in. Perhaps I can find a way to distract them. A wise strategy, Aha. <laughs> Have you not been informed of the death of Sumac? Indeed, Aha. He was a great man. He was. Now sound the call of mourning to usher him to the afterlife. Yes, Aha. I will play. Tragedy. I must see Shoko. It's calm. Come in. How did it happen? When we arrived, Shoko, the mistress of the house, was arguing with Daruka, her servant. Sumak lay dead between them. Daruka was covered in blood. Did Shoko witness the murder? No. She came home from the market to find Daruka standing over Sumak. Has Daruka confessed? No, he pleads innocence. But you're here now, Ahau. Few can lie under the scrutiny of the gods. Hmm. When he confesses, speak with the investigator. He's up near the body. Oh, Ahau, please show mercy. I swear I didn't kill my master. Be calm, Taruka. Tell me what happened. I came in from working the fields. I heard a loud noise, like a gate slamming shut. I ran and found Suma covered in blood. He'd been stabbed. I, I tried to stop the bleeding, but he was already gone. That's why your hands are bloody. Ahau, please believe me. I'll return if I have any more questions. Hello? Shoko? Yes, Aho. I know this is difficult, but I need you to tell me what happened. I was at the market with... Oh, poor Sumac. Take your time. Start from the beginning. You are at the market? Yes, with Agna. I was going to make bok chuk. It's... It was my husband's favorite. Akna? One of my servants. What happened when you came home? I found Taruka in the kitchen, standing over Sumak. His hands covered in my husband's blood. I yelled and the guards arrived. Was he holding a weapon? No. Did you hear a loud slam as you arrived? Uh, uh, no, of course not. What about Akna? What about her? She was with me. She accompanied me to the market and back. Where is she now? Recovering in her room. She's had quite a shock. I'll go talk to her. But... Uh, yes, of course. <clears throat> As you wish, Aho. Yeah, 
guys who are about suspicious as they come. Greetings, Ahao. What do you have? Sumak was stabbed in the neck many times with something pointy and very sharp. Like an arrow or a knife? Whatever it was, it's gone now. We've searched the entire room. Then the murderer took the weapon with them. May I have a look at the body? Of course. May the gods grant you the wisdom to see what I can. <sighs> For a stab wound, there's not much blood. This will never be clean. I must. I promise. Hello, Akma. Oh, Ahau. Forgive me, I thought you were the mistress. I was hoping to ask you a few questions. Uh, I don't know anything. I, I never know anything. Does this gate open? The gate? No, no, no. It's broken. It has been broken for, for a long time. Akna. I'll find another way around. There's something there. There are bloody tracks on the floor. Yes, yes, I already spotted that. As I told you, Daruka, the servant, was found with blood on his hands. <laughs> It was on. Ah, uh, how? Hello? Is it true? Sumak was murdered? Yes, I'm looking for Akna. I have questions for her. The servant girl? <laughs> I wouldn't waste any time on her. She doesn't know anything. She can't even see what's going on right in front of her eyes every day. What do you mean? I apologize, how It's not my place to speak. If you know something, tell me. Let's just say Shoko and Sumak didn't have the most passionate of marriages. Shoko always had eyes for Ikal. Ikal? Sumak's business partner. So they were friends? They're much more than friends, I think. Thank you for the information. The pleasure is mine, Ahau. More blood. Someone tried to clean this. This must be where Sumac was killed. <laughs> the ground was disturbed here, recently. This must be the knife used in the murder. Put it back! You must! The mistress said if anyone saw it, she would get in trouble. Why would she get in trouble? Please, Ahau, don't make me! If anything happened to the mistress... You need to tell me everything. The mistress didn't come to the market with me. When I got back to my room, the gate was broken and there was blood everywhere. As the mistress called for the guards, she gave me the knife to hide. I'm so sorry. Thank you for your honesty, Agna. Please. <laughs> Please forgive me, Ahau. Please. Shoko will be brought to justice. Oi, chop of what, boy? Funny that, suddenly. Taruka is guilty, Ahau. I'm sure of it.
Hakal, Turuka is innocent. Sumak was killed by his wife, Shoko. I found the knife she used. Arrest her! No! Shoko wasn't at the market. She waited until Taruka and Akno were away, then she stabbed Sumak in the neck several times. That's a lie! Sumak fell in the passage back there. Shoko moved his body where Taruka would easily find him. You're lying! Then she slammed the inner gate shut to attract Taruka's attention. She gave Akno the knife and told her to hide it. Then she confronted Taruka and blamed him for the murder. Silence! You will both be dealt with. Please, accept this as a token of our gratitude. Taruka, you're free to go. Thank you, Ahal. Sometimes there is justice. Sometimes. Kolki! Kolki! Kolki came while you were freeing the others. We didn't know he was a Jaguar warrior. He offered me payment. How could I refuse? You should have, Boma. Kugul Khan hates outsiders and traitors. <laughs> Death to the one who defies Kugul Khan! There! The outsiders of Kugul Khan <laughs>
Was not just there.
Mayu, where's the wheel? Is everything all right? I don't know. Her father came and collected her. He said he wanted to reward her for her studies and let her participate in a ritual. What doesn't sound What ritual? The ritual of awakening. A how? That involves the sacrifice of a child. Do you think a wheel's father would harm her? I've known him for years. Today, when he came, he looked right through me. His eyes were black empty where did he take her to the abandoned village please hurry well this got very serious all of a sudden didn't it Waiting for you. This way. Let's get on with it. Stop the ritual. Begin the ritual. <laughs> ah, Ahau. I present to you my own blood. My daughter, Awil. Her mind and spirit are strong. Stronger than any I've ever seen. I am so, so proud of my wheel. She will make a fine sacrifice. Here, the nectar of awakening. Hear me, Kinicha Hao, face of the sun. I offer you a wheel, the chosen one. She will drink from the nectar of awakening and her heart will be taken from her chest and cast onto the fire. The embers of my own flesh and blood given to you so that you may not to extinguish the sun. Awil, it's Lara. I want you to run back to Mayu when I say, okay? 
Why do I get the feeling this is over? Jesus, he almost died. He has got me. Yeah. Oh, I got him. A wheel, are you hurt? I'm fine. I ran just like you said. Clever girl. Why did you stop the ritual? A wheel, you were going to be killed. But that's how it is. I was chosen. My sacrifice would keep Kinicha Hao from taking the sun away. Father said he dreamed me, dreamed that I was special. A wheel, dreams can be interpreted in different ways. What if you were meant to stay here, on Earth, and use your special power to become the greatest serpent god there ever was? Do you really think so? I do, yes. I can't wait to tell father. Awil, your father is... Going to be away for a while. So Awil will stay with me, so she can continue her studies. Of course. I better get started now. There's still so much to learn. Thank you, Ahau. Yes, thank you, Ahau. I will make sure our will is cared for. Please accept this bow as a thank you. It belonged to my mother. She was an eagle archer. May it serve you well. Thank you, Mayu. I better get started now. There's still so much to learn. Thank you, Ahau.
looks like this very place. There are many men moving through it. Even more lay dead. And this, it's the shield. The prize they are all seeking. This is a trial. Just as Koryonka said, the path of Hurakan, the god of wind and storms. further than I realized. bridge might have fallen due to an earthquake. door open, so they blasted through the ground.
there or is it behind it? structures for centuries.
is gone. Jonah! Laura, what is it? Put Karyanka on. Karyanka, the shield's been taken. Then Amaru has it already. He wouldn't risk bringing it back into the city. It must be even deeper within the mountain. All right, I'll go after it. This details the ordination ritual Koryanka mentioned. During the cleansing, after the cataclysms, the eclipse will appear. Using the key of Shakshal, open the silver box and absorb the energy of Kugul Khan. Here, where I'm standing, it shows the shield of the Age Maker resting in its cradle.
There's an eclipse, and here, fire, water, these are the cataclysms. It's a cleansing. Emperor Shinchi Chika stands at the highest point in the city. Hundreds of people are gathered below him, huddled beneath the shielded. He's remaking the world, bringing about the next age. Yeah. <laughs> 
There's a way in somewhere. Jonah, Korianka was right. The cult moved the shield deeper into the mountain. Korianka, Laura found it. The Age Maker's shield. I knew it was true. It's beautiful. I'm. Maker exists. As much as it pains me to think, this knowledge can never find Unaratu's ears. 
If she knew that Sinchi Chika's shield was here, it would give her the courage she needs to rise in Sairi's place. I know she has already started to draw plans against me. We should be mourning Sairi's death together, as family. Instead, we are both plotting against the other. I wish it were different. I truly do. The goddamn shield! No Fuck shame in giving up! Need to get back to the village.
All right, I'm here. She just shortcutted me straight to the. All right, fair enough. Lara, you did it. The shield of the Age Maker. It's. What's wrong? It's the ritual. Sacrifice the weaving. No, not weaving. Destiny. And sacrifice. It can also mean creation. The traditional interpretation is we all create destiny. It's just as I thought. Look, the symbol here. Ancestors. But couldn't that also mean imposters? Yes. That's what Amaru wants. Proof that anyone can create destiny. Not only the descendants of the first emperor. You're right. No one can ever see this. This truth would shake Unuratu's faith. It will jeopardize the entire rebellion. That would only embolden Amaru's belief that he is the one destined to remake the world. Lara, we have to destroy it. There must be another way. But the truth wouldn't stay hidden forever. I think you're right. Together then, as sisters. Together. Despite this outcome, you showed great courage retrieving the shield. This bow was given to me when I joined the Shorn Ones. Never take a step backwards in battle. That is the single oath we take. You did not take a step backwards in battle today, Lara. You have the heart of a Shorn One. And I would be honored if you would keep the bow. Koryanka, this is... The honor is all mine. Thank you. Is that the shield? I don't even want to know why you're burning that. I'm just glad you made it back. Again. I'm not convinced it'll actually burn. It's gone now though, so I guess so. Uh... I'm sorry, do you have more? You're the other one anyway, just need to. Hello. Hello. I've told you that is not a toy. What is it? That's my new trophy. It was Amaru's most treasured possession. He wore it on a string around his neck, close to his heart. But you found a way to steal it. I had to. Do you know what it is? It's a cipher wheel. A coded message. Yes. And if Amaru goes to the trouble of putting a message in code, we have to know what that message is. Let me try. Maybe the code leads to the place of the flooded underworld. In the Mayan Cross, water comes from the south, and south is associated with the color yellow. Road, mountain, sky, east. That seems promising. Lining up the symbols has given me a possible location. Do these mean anything to you? Mountain Road, Sky Road, East Mountain? Yes. Amaru and his family lived near the base of the Eastern Mountain while he was growing up. So he would know the area very well, making it the perfect place for him to hide something important. I'll let you know what I find. I'm looking forward to it. Oh, I can't believe they just gave me another side quest. <laughs> Can I hand in the side quest I've already got, please? Right, that one 
hands. Well done. You should be ticked off, but you're not, and that's really quite annoying me. With yellow in the south, the exposed symbols are road, mountain, sky, east. Ah, Lara. Quenty returned a short while ago. A little worse for wear, but alive. I'm glad to see you're okay as well. That system is quite a challenge. I'm happy Quenty made it back. <sighs> Without the Savior's amulet, I'm afraid. You mean this Savior's amulet? What? Laura, you found it. That's incredible. Here. I can't thank you enough. When Zan returns with the Champion's Bow, we will honor all of the gatherers. Including you, if you join us. I'll be there. I should have done something. Now Unaratu is captured. You did all you could. And the other rebels, they'll make an example of them. We can't focus on that right now. God, what a mess. Why is that not ticked off? There's two of them that should be ticked off and on. Okay. Seems 
was a good place to leave it. That was quite a long video, so the other side quest and the main quest can wait. I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.